Heaven's California <laughs> back to my channel it's Leslie again with another video and this is my haul time video so if you like keep watching and before we get started don't forget to like subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video I went and bought a few things and I bought like clearance items and I bought just things for you know just full price so they're all purchased from the same place, Walmart, and I just love shopping there. Who doesn't love shopping there? Yeah. Okay, so let's start with the clearance items first. The clearance items that I purchased, and these, yeah, I was shocked because everything was a dollar, okay? And those are like, oh my god, those are stills. So first of all, I got this uh, travel size LA Tan Luxury Sunless Mousse black bronzing medium two to three week tan and it's just a small little bottle and I haven't used it yet I have bought this stuff about a week ago so I haven't touched any of it maybe a couple things but I haven't opened any of the makeup or anything so we're gonna do that now so this is in the shade medium and I wanted to try this because I'm a big fan of sunless tanners and I'm gonna try this soon and see how it looks that was a dollar okay that was a dollar the next thing that I got was um, this Equate Beauty Ultra Sheer Sunscreen Lotion with SPF 30. This was only a dollar as well. And I love sunblock. You know, I never leave the house without sunblock. I don't care if it's wintertime or summertime or springtime or whatever. I always have sunblock on at all times. And yeah, this kind of reminds me of the Neutrogena sunblock. One of the Neutrogena, you know. Okay, the next thing I got was I purchased two. Okay, I purchased two, and it's a L'Oreal uh, Sublime Bronze Summer Express. It's a wash off body and makeup lotion in the shade medium. And these are pretty good sized bottles. They're just like, you know, uh, body makeup. And it smells, it smells pretty good. It's nice. So, I got two, a couple of those. I'm not sure if they're going to be selling these anymore, which is probably why they were only a dollar. So, I will wear these sometime, or if you want me to try these out, just let me know. The next thing that I got was Wet n Wild, of course. I got three lip glosses. These are my Wet n Wild lip glosses. Okay, These were only a dollar a piece. And it's the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid... Liquid Lips Gloss. One of them's in the shade Cherry on Top. I haven't opened them. So it's just, it's really pretty, like burgundy color. So it's like got some shimmer to it. But I'm not sure if they're going to be selling these anymore or not. And like I said, I haven't even, I haven't done any of these yet. But I'll go ahead and swatch this color for you so you can see. It's really pigmented, it's really nice, but there's the shade. Okay, and this is the Wet n Wild Cherry on top. So there's that one. The next one is another lip gloss from Wet n Wild, and this one is in the shade Raising the Roof. This is Raising the Roof, and I'm gonna go ahead and swatch that one really quick. So this is pretty. This is kind of like a plum, like a it's like a purple color more, like a wine color. It's this, it's this color here. Okay. There's that color. And the next color that we got is Do I Make You Blush? And I'm going to go ahead and swatch this one here. This is pretty. This is like a pink shimmer. Like a fuchsia almost. Right there. Okay. And that is Do I Make You Blush? The next thing that I got was um, the Mega, Mega Slicks balm and coral of the story that's what shade it is it's just like a balm you can put on your lips i'm not too big on these but since it was a dollar i went ahead and got it anyway so the next thing that i got was an essie nail polish and this was on sale for i think four dollars and this is in the shade minimalistic 308 this is the essie and i actually have it on right now 
And I think it's a really pretty color. I am a big fan of pink and especially baby pinks, you know. I love that. Okay, let's see. The next thing that I have is... Let's see. I got the Salon Perfect eyelashes. The Demi Wispies right here. And it came with five. There's five of them in here. And I also have this lash adhesive. And I, I opened this because I needed some and I didn't have anything else. So this is the, uh, this is new, I believe. Well, I don't know if it's new, but it's the uh, Strip Lash Adhesive, the natural way to wear uh, false lashes. And it's with aloe vera. So these are pretty good. I like these. It, um, a non-irritating secure hold. So I took the last one from the store. So I do have that. And I just, I just love it. The next thing that I got was the Revlon eyelash curler. I needed another eyelash curler because my my last one kind of got a little messed up. So I got I just got an eyelash curler. The next thing that I got was Wet n Wild color icon brunettes do it better, and this is just an eyebrow pencil. So it's got like the pencil right here and it's got like the, the little spoolie brush thingy on the end there. Okay. So I got that. I'm going to try this out because I love Wet n Wild. And then the next thing that I got from Wet n Wild is um, a liquid eyeliner in the shade Black. I never, I mean, I, no, I never had a liquid eyeliner from Wet n Wild and I really wanted to try it. I am a big fan of liquid eyeliners and I'm willing to try anything. Okay. So I got one of those. Oh, I forgot to mention, before I continue that, I did have one more clearance item from Went Wild that I forgot to mention. And this is just one of the crayon pencils. It's um, it's like a jumbo crayon and it's in the shade Electro, which is kind of like a navy blue. Kind of like a gray navy blue with a shimmer to it. But, uh, you know, a dollar, so I wanted to get that. And then... Okay, back to where we were with all of the items that I purchased for that. I got another Wet n Wild item, and this is the Amped Black. It's uh, the volume plus up to 10 times volume uh, mascara. And I just wanted to try it because I never tried one of their mascaras, so this would be my first for Wet n Wild. And I just thought the wand looked pretty cool. I mean, you know, I like those kind of wands. So I'm going to be trying that and I'll let you guys know how that goes. Let's see, the next thing that I got was this Wet n Wild uh, Photo Focus Setting Spray. I love this setting spray. I just love setting sprays, period. But I love Wet n Wild. So I had this before and I love it. So you need to go and pick one of those up. The next thing that I got was a Wet n Wild coverall primer face primer okay I used this before and I love this product as well so I just had to go and pick me up another one and you guys should try this if you never tried it it's a good primer from wet n wild alright and then before I get to the really good stuff that I got and I'm really excited about I'm gonna go ahead and tell you this other couple items before I get into my good or my, my good stuff okay Okay, I went and picked up an e.l.f. brush, a concealer brush, and it's a, it's a nice little cute brush. You know, I thought maybe I could just do like under my brows and stuff with concealer or, you know, something when I'm doing my brows. So I just got one of those little brushes for a dollar. Love it. And then the next thing I got from e.l.f. was, it says new, which I'm thinking it might be new. And it's the Shape and Stay Wax Pencil. I never tried this before. I've never seen this before, which is probably why it says new. But it just says the Clear Wax Pencil helps shape and tame brows for a flawless look that stays put. Enriched with antioxidant vitamin E to help nourish the skin. So uh, if you want me to do a review on this, just let me know. I've never tried it. I'm new to it myself. So more of that to come later. Okay. My favorite part here, when I went last week to Walmart on, I believe, a Saturday night, 
I didn't expect anything because the location that I go to don't normally stock their things and their cosmetic section is just it's not the best okay I'm just gonna say that it's not the best but I kind of changed my mind a little bit when I seen that they had these products that I always see online on the website or they just post these things from the site so I was really happy to get my hands on them and I'm still gonna go out and do more shopping from went wild because I have to pick up everything that they have and the first thing that I got was boom yeah I got the new wet and wild photo focus foundation in the shade buff I don't know how to pronounce that word all I know is it took me forever forever to find my shade because me, I'm not the best at matching colors. I try to be, but this was the closest thing that I got to, and I felt like it was just right for me. It looks like my matte, uh, matte foundation that I use in uh, C4.5, the shade. So I love the little wand thing, and I could just, or you could just dip it, or you could dump it, and you know, just apply. So I got this. I'm very happy that I got it. Thank you, Wet and Wild. I am. I just love this. I can't wait to try it and do a video on it. The next thing that I got was this new Wet n Wild makeup stick concealer. And I got mine in the shade Follow Your... Follow Your... I still can't pronounce that word. Bisque? Bisque? I don't know. It's in 807. So, that's the shade that I got. And I can't wait to try this. As soon as I'm done doing this video, I am going to open everything and I'm going to test it out. So, it's just really exciting. The next thing I got was this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Press Powder. And mine is in the shade Nat Neutral Beige. Okay, same thing. I had to uh, figure out what my shades were. So just go, you know, figure out your shades. It would be really nice if they had testers there. That way you could kind of test yourself, you know, match it up. But I don't know if they're ever going to do that. Then the next thing that I got was, uh, this is what first, what how I noticed it was, when I was looking, I, this was the first product that I saw from Wet n Wild, and it caught my attention fast. I got the Wet n Wild Mega Cushion Color Corrector. It brightens dullness, and I have not opened this yet, but I want to. So, I'm going to be opening this after the video, and I will look at it and let you guys know if you want. If you have any questions or you want to know about these products, just let me know. Leave me a comment below, and I will review these for you. Let's see. The next thing that I got was this Nude Awakening All Natural Wet n Wild uh, Eyeshadow Palette. Okay, this really caught my attention because I feel like they just have some beautiful colors in here. And I love eyeshadow palettes. I'm willing to try anything. But it's just so pretty. Like, they have some rose gold colors. They have, like, burgundy, some nudes. They got, like, you know, just sparkly, pretty colors. And I'm going to swatch these later on. I might do a video on... Um, like a full face routine using just wet and wild cosmetics so stay tuned for that video because I'm going to be putting that out there soon the next thing that I got was the new wet and wild uh, color icon color icon ombre blush and this is in the shade the princess daiquiris see it's really pretty it's just a nice color ombre of course so it's got like some peachy colors some orange looking just mixed together you know I have one of these in purple haze and I just love it I love it the next thing that I was really excited about to get my hands on was uh, the wet n wild these are new also the highlighting powder and it's in the shade crown of my canopy and these are really pretty like oh my gosh guys I love highlighters and these are so pretty like you know what? I am so excited about this product. I I am just going to open it. And I'm going to swatch it right now because I have been trying not to open these. Just to show you guys that I do have like control. And I could control myself even no matter how much I love makeup and beauty. That I could control myself. From opening this stuff and using it before I share with all of you okay oh look at that I am just I just it just oh melts me when I see these beautiful highlighters so this is the wet n wild highlighter oh my gosh I have to I'm sorry that my hands look kind of dark right now I kind of have my tanner on it's right there 
And we gotta do a better swatch here pretty soon, but I got that on there. That's really nice. But it might remind you of some of the MAC highlighters. But yeah, I got that and then this one. This is the one I just swatched and that's uh, Crown of My Canopy. And the next one is Precious Precious Petals. This one's just a little bit lighter than the one I just swatched. So that really caught my eye. Okay. Last but not least, the next thing that I got from Wet n Wild. And I still have to go back and I still have to buy out everything, okay? Because I kind of had like, I didn't want to go overboard. And yeah. And I will tell you guys in a minute. But there was one. Okay. 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 I'm guilty. I'm guilty. I lied. I'm guilty. I did open one of these. Because I got so excited I had to see. I just had to see. Okay. I am a fan of liquid lipsticks. And I seen these. The cat suit. Uh, the Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit Matte Lipsticks. And I love these. Oh my god. You have to try these. If you get your hand on one of these run okay pay for it but run then just go home and try it i did open this one i mean i really really wanted to but look how pigmented that is that is so pigmented right there it's crazy like i love this stuff i'm gonna be wearing these all the time now i cannot wait to wear i have to get all the shades but can you just look at that the wet and wild liquid lipsticks okay those are so beautiful I can't believe it like next ones that I got was the give me mocha I got the give me mocha and oh god this is so pretty it's kind of like a brown color but I just love it I just do and I will be wearing these in future videos and maybe I will do another video just like trying these on so watch them for you guys that way you can get an idea if you can't you know get your hands on them or if you haven't purchased it or you're unsure of purchasing it uh, the next one I got was Nice to Fuchsia. This is a really pretty color. It's just a fuchsia color. And this is another little lipstick by Wet n Wild. This is nice. And I will come back later and swatch all these. I'm going to do a full face on that. The next thing I got was Berry Recognize. And this is just like a berry color. It's kind of, you know, it's a little bit lighter. Well, actually, they kind of almost look alike, but you can tell the difference. Yeah, this was the fuchsia one. This is the berry one. So, that's really pretty. And I'm gonna have fun with all of these. So, anyways. I'm gonna just tell you now. All of the stuff. my Most of my Wet n Wild products. Except for... Hold on one second. Because I got some of these at different locations. Because I had other places to go. But like, my eyelash curler and all of all of my other stuff, my clearance items, all came to $87 and some change. $87 for the new Wet n Wild stuff that I got, like the eyeshadow palette, the lipsticks, the highlighters, the powder, the foundation, the concealer, eyelashes, adhesive glue, all of that except for these right here. These were a little cheaper, but that probably came to about $40 for the rest of that stuff, but everything else was like almost 90 bucks. And the lady at the counter couldn't even believe her eyes, but, you know, like something, go get it. So, anyways, if you guys have any questions or you have any, you know, something you want to ask me, just leave me a comment below and I will get right back to you. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And you guys have a nice day, and I will be back next week. Bye. Heaven's California.